Hi there, it's Allison from the Protocase team. Today I'm going to go over our template generator, specifically the DXF file export option. Our template generator gives you the option of choosing between two different file formats, STEP and DXF. DXF is short for Drawing Exchange Format, and it's a file extension for graphic image format typically used with CAD software. Check out our STEP tutorial linked below for a guide on how to import STEP files into SOLIDWORKS. Okay, so I've already used the template generator to create an L-shape enclosure in a DXF file. Now I'm going to open it in DraftSite. You can use another CAD program if you'd like, such as AutoCAD. Here we can see six different views in the third angle projection. Front, left, right, top, bottom, and back. Each view contains the face profile, cutouts, exclusions, and view origin. Exclusion zones are in their own layer and they display as dashes. The layer name is exclusions. Face profile is the outer outlines layer, while cutouts are in the inner outlines layer. Most CAD programs allow you to hide layers as needed. You can find important information such as a template type, depth, height, width, material thickness, and material type in a note in the lower right of your screen. The view origin is the origin of the enclosure. So now that you have your DXF enclosure template open, you can edit it by adding profiles to the faces you want to customize. One thing to note, as mentioned, the DXF template has exclusion zones, which are displayed as dashes. You should try to avoid exclusion zones if at all possible. Our engineering and design services team can assist when they review your design before it's manufactured. However, we still recommend avoiding exclusion zones to streamline the work required before your design gets built. Once you're done editing your enclosure with all the customizations you require for your project, you can save your file as a DWG, DXF, or PDF. When you're ready to get your design quoted, send it to your Protocase account manager directly, or you can email the file to info at protocase.com if you aren't already connected with the Protocase account manager for your region. Thanks very much for watching, and happy designing!